hello viewers welcome to my channel technical tactics today i'm gonna show you if the bios is hanged and your device is stuck on boot logo what should i do let's begin you are seeing that i have a dell laptop which is latitude 3330 and it's stuck on boot logo it's not working correctly and if i want to go to in the bios that means the boot menu of this device it's not working correctly f12 boot menu is not working and uh, if i want to go to bios menu then my device is not entering in the BIOS so what should I do there are many way to solve this problem you can um, execute the firmware of your BIOS and then flash it uh, over using the BIOS menu but my device is not correctly working and I can't execute the BIOS firmware so what should I do I need to disassemble the laptop now you can see I have disassembled my laptop and I have just disassembled it make sure that there is no power supply on this device so I have to remove the complementary metal oxide semiconductor that means CMOS battery I have just disconnected the CMOS battery from my motherboard now I have to remove the all screws from the motherboard so that I can access easily to the motherboard. I have unscrewed all the screw from my motherboard. Now I have to connect the power source with the adapter and do the further step. I have just plugged the power source with my adapter. And now I have to disconnect the part of the motherboard where the HDMI or PGA is connected with it almost all the devices that are now can be found the VGA or HDMI port which are connected to the motherboard may be a sub PCB so I have to disconnect that sub PCB from my main motherboard here is the HDMI port and the LAN port where is my PCB is connected to the main motherboard so I need to disconnect this LAN port or HDMI port sub PCB from my main motherboard you can see my device is connected to this part which is just a grounding so I just disconnect this from my motherboard now I need a USB hub as there is no physical keyboard or the touchpad so I need a USB hub so that I can connect a USB keyboard and as well as a mouse I have connected a USB mouse and a keyboard to my device and now I am going to plug the adapter with my device before doing this you have to install a RAM on your motherboard and do this work correctly now I am going to insert the adapter in my device now press the F2 button now go to system configuration integrated NIC untick the enable UEFI network start apply then exit 
Now just assemble your laptop. And you see my device is working correctly. No disturbance over it. Thanks for watching my video. I'll be there next time.